So hello everyone and welcome to Geeky Aya. So today I'm here to just let you know whether buying a Fitbit Versa first generation is a really good idea in 2021. So this one is now selling for around 7500 on Flipkart. So I would tell you what are the really good stuff on this. As you can see it has a Super AMOLED display and it has all your exercise mostly more than what you need and you can physically track them and some of them gets triggered by itself. So that is one. So this is more of a fitness tracker than a fitness watch. Then it has uh, an internal 4 GB storage. So you can store your tracks inside. And if you're somebody who goes uh, for a running or walking with this, you can listen to this through a Bluetooth headset. But mind, uh, this doesn't have a GPS functionality. So it has uh, the weather application. It has the agenda. It has the phone finder. It has Flipboard and it has the clock faces and you can save up to five clock faces uh, on this and i have downloaded a few which is really good so you're buying into this ecosystem where you have a lot of options so when you're buying into fitbit this is something which you're going to get this is something premium so i would have to give points to fitbit on that so as you can see it looks really good sadly this generation doesn't have a spo2 sensor and just showing you more options here as you can see the the os slightly lags because it just is the old generation and it is not getting the latest OS. So as you can see, this is the flip board and it, it just can configure some news and it just gives you some feeds. So this just gives some random feed guys. And uh, again, as I told you, the agenda is there. You have a drop down where you can see your notification and from bottom, if you swipe up, it will give you the daily and you can double tap to work it up. And uh, see that's 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 the exercise details, the step counter, the heartbeat sensor which it has, it shows, and it'll show you how healthy you are according to your age. So these these are some good stuff which you're getting when you buy into a Fitbit. So apart from that, uh, so that's a quick setting. So apart from that, I don't think it is really worth it, even if you're paying seven thousand five hundred for this. Now I'm buying into an ecosystem which is really good. It has a plethora of options. But still the OS is pretty slow as of now. So if you're buying something, I would rather say you can um, invest your money on something which is much better than this. As you can see the settings here, it has most of the option screen to awake uh, shortcut options. If you go to the about options, as you can see, I've used it for almost one and a half years. Um, that's the latest version which is running on this and uh, I have not got uh, the latest OS on this one. So if you're looking for a smartwatch, look somewhere else guys. Thanks for watching.